So we took our first trip to Hawaii and actually ate as much poke as we can. And from there, we came back, we said we're changing the whole concept. We definitely have to do it traditional, not alter it and change it. My name's Hoi Nguyen, aloha, welcome to Pokehana. Just by traveling to Hawaii and eating the poke out in Hawaii, uh, made me want to bring that kind of quality poke back to Orlando. So we serve traditional Hawaiian food, uh, mainly specializing in poke. Poke is just cut fish on top of rice. We have a lot of rice plates. We do acai bowls. Acai bowl, the kawaii one. Instead of kiwi, I got blueberries. Good. A bunch of traditional Hawaiian desserts as well. Butter mochi, that's a staple. So there's a lot of a, a lot of people see poke and Hawaiian food as uh, just cut fish on top of rice, and then they just put toppings and pour sauce all in it. All of our fish, seafood's all marinated. I mean, we use like the poke salts. Traditional Hawaiian poke is actually marinated poke. Uh, you got machi, you got your octopus, your salmon. A lot of key ingredients like the poke salt and the seaweed has to be shipped in from Hawaii. Uh, that's what gives our, I think, our food the most authentic taste. Uh, the closest thing you get to Hawaiian poke, mainland. <laughs> First impression? So good. <laughs> Basically, we want to just give everybody uh, a relaxing vibe. We don't want to go over the top and you know make it too tiki or people will, how people see uh, Hawaii with the bright colors and everything. When you come in here, we want to make you relax and feel like you're not in Orlando. You're actually in Hawaii while you're dining here. What brought you in for the first time? Good reviews, obviously, yeah, otherwise you wouldn't come in. That's cool. Yeah. A lot of people still don't know what Hawaiian food is, and we just want them to come in, try it out, see the chill atmosphere and the great food that we have to offer. Walking cooler slash freezer. Compliments of One Fat Frog. I think we've bought every single equipment, including the three compartment sink from One Fat Frog. So I've, I've worked with One Fat Frog uh, over 10 years. Every restaurant I've ever opened, I go to Connie and Amin. These guys, they treat me like family. They take care of everything from start to finish, pre-planning on the equipment, all the way to installation and permitting. Even after everything's done, they always call and check up on me. Probably like the only thing I would recommend to any restaurant opener, people that start to open up a restaurant, it helps to have someone like that behind you. Vinny is my cousin, and then Noel is my childhood friend. I've known him since like fifth grade. He looked like a child, but he's actually he's actually pretty old. <laughs> The staff here is all like friends and family. To be honest, uh, restaurants a lot of work. The staff is my favorite part. Uh, getting a, a good bunch of guys. We have all good energy to work off each other. And then we have great customers. Uh, and and just, that just shows and reflects into the food that we put out. We try to do as everything as authentic as possible. So our music that we play actually is Hawaiian music. Uh, it's not like, it's, it's actual artists from Hawaii. So the music is dope here. It's pretty dope here. Yeah. <laughs> now we're all set. We start. You're fired, bro. <laughs> You're fired. Hey, man. You're a camera guy. You should have known how to turn that off. <laughs> I don't, I don't mess with this stuff. No? I only take pictures. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, and the other one, I just wrote, use a hey, road I'm, mic. I'm not an audio guy, I want the phone still. Yeah. So. <laughs> I just use a road mic and that's, that's all you need. <laughs> camera on camera. <laughs>